This is a rock cycle with Thomas and Gunner. This is the rock cycle. A rock cycle is when a volcanic eruption happens and the lava cools off into an igneous rock. After a while, the igneous rock will start to break up and turn into sediment. The sediment will be um, packed together to get the sedimentary rock. Then the sedimentary rock will break into pieces and come together with like sand and salt and other kind of rocks. And after the metamorphic rock is formed, it will start to sink into the ground and it will reach magma. Once it gets to magma, it will melt into really hard, or well, not hard, but really liquidy rock. And then it happens again, a volcanic eruption, igneous rock, sediment, sedimentary rock, metamorphic rock, magma, and it keeps on going. This is an igneous rock chart. My favorite is this one. The way igneous rocks are formed is through a volcanic eruption. And after the volcanic eruption, lava will pour down on the side of the volcano. And after a while, it will cool off and harden into these three rocks. This is a sediment rock. And a sediment rock is when all, when a rock is falling down the mountain and it gets crushed and crushed and crushed where it falls in pieces and it kind of turns into sand. And then it gets, and then it has a long way to go before it turns into a rock. And then a river and, and it goes into rivers and oceans and it gets all moist up, moist together and it turns into one good, awesome rock again. And that's a sediment rock. This is a sedimentary rock. And the sedimentary rock is formed from when sediment comes with other ingredients um, like you name it. And to make a rock like sandstone, you know, all sorts of different stuff to make a new rock that is a mixture of different ingredients. This is a metamorphic rock. And the reason it's a um, metamorphic rock is because after a sediment rock, um, sediment rock goes with other rocks to make a metamorphic rock. So it's a bunch of little rocks put together in different colors, as you can see right here. Well, that's a metamorphic rock. This is magma, and the way magma is formed is when rocks will fall into a volcano, and the volcano will erupt, turn into lava or magma, like you see here.